all right let's solve this equation okay so we have x raised to log 4 plus 4 raised to log x equals to 32. now before we start anytime you are given log of let's see something without the base the base by default is 10. so if you don't see the base it's 10. okay now there is one property in logarithm that we need to take note of now if i write a raised to log p to base a so because of this and that so this one is a property so you have a here raising log p to base a the answer is p so if i write 10 raised to log x now by default the base here is 10 so 10 10 half x okay now with this let's solve the question here <clears throat> okay now first thing to do is to remove this log x so let's represent log x by a variable so let let log x be k okay now we said if we don't see the base this side is 10 so by default that is 10 so my x is we know the 10 will raise this k so we have x equals to 10 to the power k so x is 10 to the power k so let's do substitution we have x here so let's put x there that is 10 to the power k so we have 10 to the power k all raised to so we have log 4 okay plus 4 so we have log x as k so i'll put k here equals 32 all right now let's observe something in case we're given x raised to n okay all times p the same as x raised to n p so we have this one as pa and this one as pa so it means this one is the same as 10 raised to k log 4 plus 4 to the power k equals 32 now let's observe something from the power rule of logarithm log a to the power t to base c is the same as t log a to base c so this one is a power rule so which will come here so we have 10 raised to log 4 raised to k okay plus 4 to the power k equals to 32 now let's recall this property now we said if we don't see the base it's 10 so we have 10 raised to log something to base 10 so 10 here 10 there so this side is 4 raised to k so 4 raised to k plus 4 raised to k equals to 32 all right so we can go ahead and solve for k here so we have so many ways so let's factorize 4 raised to k out 
So you have level one plus one here equals to thirty two. So you have four raised to k times two equals thirty two. So let's divide both sides by two. I have this. So this side thirty two divided by two. So we have four raised to k. But 16. So let's solve this exponential equation for the power k is same as for the power 2. Therefore, k is 2. Remember, we have the x, not k. So let's do substitution. So we have x here. x equals 10 to the power k. So my x is straight away 10 to the power because k is 2 so we have 100 as the answer all right